Graham, what were your, your takeaway points from that? That was a, a frantic end to the game, wasn't it? But it took a while for the game to kind of come to life. Yeah, it seems to be it seems to be the way. That's that's the second time we've uh, we've we've played a home FA Cup game. Um, obviously, Bromley um, forced, which it took us it took us forty five minutes. It took us a tongue lash and a half time. It took us maybe a little bit of change of system, change of shape to get us going, to get us moving. Uh, a little bit lacklustre. Um, I don't know whether the lads like Sunday. I don't know whether they they, they like the FA Cup. I, I, I can't tell you. But uh, it's a little bit. Um, it's concerning. It takes us a little bit to get going and to get us warmed up. Um, so uh, it was a it was an EV, a mediocre first half to be quite honest. We had one or two opportunities, they had one or two opportunities, but other than that, there wasn't an awful lot uh, in the game. But the second half, a couple of tackles here and there really caught uh, really caught fire. Change of shape, in fairness, um, helped us as well. So um, I thought we were uh, I thought we were worthy of a, of a victory, but uh, unfortunately, circumstances um, arose that uh, that has maybe taken a victory from my hands. Liam Sirkin on the score sheet again. How good is it to see him kind of back to what we know he does best, kind of getting in those attacking positions and finding the goals from pretty much all angles? Yeah, Sirk is, uh, is he's, he's had a really good week actually. To be quite honest, his his, uh, his wife and himself has had a baby, so we congratulate them on, on, on that as well. And and he's and he's capped off his week with the goal. It's unfortunate it wasn't a winning goal. Um, even after the uh, the catastrophic uh, decision, it was. Um, an opportunity down Luke Leahy, I think Crash went off the crossbar, I thought we were going to nick it at the end. Um, and then what's what's unfolded then after that was was uh, was, was really poor to be honest. But um, look, we, we got a decision against Bromley. Um, we've had a lot of decisions go against us today. So look, that's, that's football, it's part and parcel. And just quickly on that penalty decision, firstly uh, Ansi making the, stay, making the save right at the end to keep us in the, in the cup. It must be great to see a goalkeeper finding his form and finding his rhythm as well to not be put off by conceding a spot kick to the same penalty taker kind of 10 minutes prior. Yeah, there was plenty of noise behind the goal as well and uh, it, it was it was concentration and focus was, was called for. But uh, I think it would have been a, a travesty had, uh, had that been a match winning penalty had we gone out of the FA Cup because of that decision. Um, I'd like the officials maybe to... to, to, to hand in the air, made an error, move on, rescind the red card, no harm done, let's get on with it. Um, because that, that, that's, that would be the just, that would be the brave and that would be the, uh, the manful decision to make. Um, we shouldn't be stood here after games of football discussing referees and discussing um, decisions. I refuse to get embroiled in the, uh, the dark side of the game. Um, I'm, I'm more concentrating on, uh, on, on, on our players and on a, and on a really good, feisty um, return leg at uh, a home park in, in 10 days time we're really looking forward to it, to be honest because uh, I don't think we played to our, to our max today and then obviously attention now turns to Wednesdays and that's a knock, another knockout tie against Leighton Orient the Leighton.com trophy how the lads kind of morale and, and shape up for that one Morale is fine. Morale is fine. The lads are in good spirits. The club is in a good place. We're really positive. I I I don't know. I I guess um, I guess that's 16, 17 games, is it? Now we've gone, and well, I think we've had nine wins and and, and, and two defeats. So uh, it's really really positive at the minute. And the place is bubbling. The place is flying. Um, we should have. Let's be honest. We should have had another victory under our belts today. Progress in the cup. But we've got a really vital important game on Wednesday night and then we've uh, we've another league game on Saturday so they come ticking fast we play next Tuesday we play the following Saturday so that's what the squad is for the squad will have to be utilised so uh, there'll be opportunity and chance for all the individuals to go and stake uh, claims and stake longevity in the team